Hi, I'm at BenQ invite only room. For the longest time, I never thought BenQ is doing anything serious. I thought, you know, they do this type of projector, you know, fun stuff projector, not serious projector. But today, I was proven wrong. Yes, I can be wrong. For coming to our booth, so right here we have our GP500 Smart Home Entertainment Projector. This is a tabletop projector, so meaning that you don't have to put your projector up in a, in a mount, you don't have to drill holes in your wall, you don't need any special uh, mounts to be able to use this projector, right? Um, the way I describe it is this projector conforms to your home as opposed to the home conforming to the projector, which often is the case with some of our bigger projectors, right? So this projector is actually super user friendly as well. It has object avoidance, meaning that if there's something blocking the, the, the projection, the projection automatically uh, moves. It has auto keys to the keystone, it has auto focus, screen fit, so if you have a screen, it automatically reads the screen and it, it expands it or, or shortens it to make sure that it's within the parameters of the screen. Here is the sensor that we talk about. Um, this comes equipped with an ATV dongle, so you're gonna have all of your all of your streaming apps that you can need, uh, with the exception of being Netflix um, for licensing reasons. This has a 360 degree sound field. Um, these are 20 watt speakers all around. The connectivity of it is amazing. We have two HDMI ports, two US, USB-A, uh, two A ports, audio out, SPDIF. Um, then we have our power adapter. And superior sound by Travolo. Yep. And so the thing that makes this really, really, really unique, especially for first time projector owners that might be thinking about buying a projector and I'm wanting to commit full time to maybe adjust, maybe setting one up in their home. Again, this is, this is a, pro, a, a tabletop projector. You can easily move this around and with all those features like the corner, corner, uh, angle, uh, corner projection, um, the object avoidance, it's easy to set up and kind of work around your home layout, right? Um, another really neat thing is, let's say you have this projector up against a wall and it's blocking these, these right projections. You can adjust the projection so that all the sound is being emitted directly onto from the open projection so it isn't bouncing off the walls. Um, this is 4K quality. Again, it's, it's the way I would describe this is this is a home entertainment projector. In a, it's essentially home entertainment in a box. Um, you have everything you can need for home entertainment, all the content you can want, 4K resolution, amazing imagery. Um, it's 4 LED light source. So it's, this is an amazing, amazing projector that I am personally a really big fan of. Might be biased, but I love it. Now, if we move down to here, David, like you mentioned, I know you said that you thought BenQ was only a, a fun projection, right? So we do have our fun projectors. This is our GV30, 300 anti-lumen, two hour battery life. Uh, it can project up to 150, 150 inch screen. Um, the, the unique step, the new points are that you can project onto awkward angles, right? Oftentimes homes, especially like let's say you want to create a home entertainment space in your attic, you're going to have those slanted walls. So this is perfect for that, right? You can, you can watch content on your bed, laying down. Um, and yeah, so it's, it, it will adjust to your room. And the thing with these, and they, this, these two, so this is the GV11, right? The sister model to the GV30. The only difference being they're virtually identical. They both come equipped with ATV uh, dongle. The difference being this is 300 anti-lumens, this is 200 anti-lumens, this is 720p resolution, this is 480p resolution. But again, the amazing sound for how small they are. You get amazing sound out of them. Amazing projection. Um, again, super flexible. And these, we love these projectors because for people that might be on the fence on buying a projector or even entering into the projector world, these are super easy to commit to because they're very user friendly, right? They don't take up much space. If you want, you can put them away, put, put them away if you need to into its carrying case um, and it's easy to connect. You can just turn it on and you have a full projection You're with all the apps, all the content that you might need. Um, can I see the back? Where, oh yeah, this, here are the connectors. Yep. And like I said, we do, it comes equipped with ATV dongle. However, if you want to connect your own streaming dongle, you're able to do so. Perfect. And given the audio quality, this can act as a speaker in itself as well. Um, they, yeah, th both of these have amazing audio. Like if you want to just, I'm a big podcast listener. So like if you want to just pre listen to some podcasts while relaxing or having the time to yourself or maybe just projecting content that you might want to watch. And they come with a bag. Yes. These bags all come with it. 
Um, they're really cool. The little lunch boxes, essentially. Um, they're padded, protected. So, and this is essentially how it will come. So you'll have your dongle, you'll have your user manual, your power uh, source, and yeah, you'll have the whole fittings and you can take it with you as you go. And now I'm gonna show you why I've been wrong all this time. Right. So, hello, uh, it is a BenQ HT4550i. Uh, this new projector is going to launch in Q2. So, you can see actually it's not lamp anymore. It's a full LED uh, home theater projector. So, you can see the color is so uh, vibrant, it's so pop. Why? Because uh, when we use a LED library, the bright thing can be brighter, and the dark thing we use a LED dimming technology can dim to 40%. And also, thank you, we use a new technology, we call it as a local contrast enhancer. So, you can see this big screen actually. We can divide them by 32 by 32. So actually there are 10, 24 small square on the screen. Each one has the uh, gamma we can adjust. So it's kind of a local dimming technology. Uh, first kind of projector. And of course this one is for home theater. So it's a 32 uh, 100 lumens. Uh, good in dark room but also good uh, in the bright living room. And we know a lot of AV enthusiastic, they love to fine tune everything with their own projector, right? So this time we design the advanced color temperature setting for those uh, AV enthusiastic. So here we can see the advanced color temperature fine tune. Uh, original only have R, B, G. But now this time we provide uh, another point uh, for those uh, if you start to find here each own uh, RGB so they can have their own uh, combination. And furthermore is the picture mode. Actually uh, we do provide two kind of a different picture mode for a user to choose. One is our own BenQ home making technology cinematic color, HDR10, and call standard. But we also do the filmmaker mode uh, to follow the standard. So you can choose either one. So there you go. I've been wrong, I've been corrected. Thank you very much for watching and goodbye.